My name is Dr. Joseph Arena. I'm a holistic physician out of South Florida. I work with a company known as King Canine, uh, who makes an incredible product known as King Calm CBD. So what is CBD? CBD is cannabidiol, and what cannabidiol is, is an active ingredient in, uh, in hemp, also in cannabis. Stay here, girl. And what it does is it's been shown to have immunological boosting properties, antioxidant properties, and also overall um, anti-inflammatory properties. The U.S. has, it's okay girl, has held a patent for it for about 25 years. And um, it's just starting to become more known now as far as the medicinal applications and uh, what it's good for. Well, there are a lot of applications that CBD can be used for. Uh, the main ones of concern these days are inflammation, number one, uh, including arthritis, anxiety, you know, if your dog suffers from, whether it be social anxiety with another animal, whether it be thunderstorms or just kind of a, a timid personality, it can help calm their nerves. So CBD has a great affinity for neurological health and a lot of times our stress, inflammation, and the, the things I mentioned all stem from the nerves. So CBD having an effect on the nerves and an affinity for the nervous system is why it works so well in this condition. Actually, no, CBD itself is the same compound. CBD will always be CBD. And the fact that there is no difference stems from the fact that canines and humans are both mammals. So as a mammal, we contain something called the endocannabinoid system. This system is what uh, contains the receptors for the actual cannabinoids. Therefore, anything with any animal with an endocannabinoid system, CBD will have an effect on. So in our case, um, horses, cats, dogs, and of course, humans. So anxiety happens to be uh, the number one thing that CBD is used for, the number one application because it's so, um, it's so common in the dog world. But the reason why is because anxiety isn't necessarily a chronic illness or a traumatic event that your dog has experienced. It's something that maybe your dog is dealing with on an everyday basis. So the, the CBD itself has an affinity for, for neurons, for nerve cells. So when you have anxiety and stress and these things compound, it usually happens through the nervous system and CBD has a great effect on, on decreasing the sensitivity of the nerves and allowing you to kind of relax a little bit more and to not be as frightened or timid and to um, and have a, a better quality of life. Also want to clear up that CBD oil often gets um, misunderstood as cannabis oil. Although you can derive CBD oil cannabidiol from cannabis, it is not the, the usual um, plant that it's derived from. We're deriving CBD from hemp and just to clear it up also, hemp um, has very low amounts of THC. So this product is pure CBD with a full spectrum of cannabinoids and has zero THC, which is the psychoactive part of, of the plant. So this, this um, will not get your dog high. Um, as a matter of fact, they won't experience any sort of psychoactive or psychotropic as we call it, anything that stimulates the brain. It's gonna relax them if anything. Um, so CBD and THC are not the same. THC would be illegal um, in all 50 states and uh, used more uh, for other medicinal purposes like cancer and things like that. Whereas CBD is more mainstream, it's legal in all 50 states, will not get your dog high, and is something that could be used for literally every application, whether it just be general health, boosting the immune system, or you know crippling, debilitating diseases like cancer, epilepsy, hip dysplasia and things like that. So a lot of times we get questions mainly on how do I dose my animal, how much do I give and how do I give it. So there's a, a doctor, a veterinary doctor by the name of Dr. Robert Silver. He practices out of Colorado where cannabis and hemp have been on the uprise for the last 15, 20 years. And his research showed that the best dosage for an animal gene generally would be 0.1 milligram per, per kilogram per day. So instead of you having to do all that math, I've already done it for you. Thank you for listening and looking forward to helping you treat your pets.